Eighth race, pacing stallions and gildings are on the track and parading to the post, racing one mile, purse two thousand dollars, field of eight. There are no changes. Nine minutes until post time, the one San Cartel, Obelisa Fuller of Wichita, Kansas, Frenchie Fuller trains and drives. Number two, Cumberbund, owned by Margaret Fox Graves of Chillicothe, Dan Eder, the trainer, Ryan Holtada. Three, I'm looking sharp, owned by Everett and Fayetta Patrick of Dayton, Everett Patrick trains for Jack Daly. Four, Simcoe's Image, owned and trained by Max Mauser of London, Darren Mauser. Five, Capable Leader, owned by Lau Mason and Makara. Doug Lau trains for Jeff Fout. Number six, Whiff, owned by Charles Geiler, Letha Brooks, and uh, Cheryl Abel of Ohio. Hugh Beatty Jr., the uh, trainer and uh, driver. Seven, Mary Colbryan, owned by James Steverson and Billy Toomey of Marion. Andrew Miller trains for Del Miller. And number eight, B.J. Sealster, owned by Richard Ross of Mount Vernon. Charlie Smith Jr. is the trainer driver. One play show perfecta trifecta wagering eight minutes until post. And uh, the draw off, and from the center of the track, it's capable leader first for the lead. Whift is right there alongside a second. And from off the pylon, San Cartel gets away third. I'm looking sharp, looking to angle in here fourth. To the inside five already is Miracle Bryan. Two lengths sixth, it's Cumberbund. And at the rail seventh, Simcoe's image of the uh, trailer eighth is B.J. Sealster around the first turn. And whipped. Takes a lead here. Capable leader on the inside is racing second. At the rail and gapping a third, San Cartel opening quarter 28 and 2. Coming past the stand, and on the front, it's Whiffed with the lead. Two lengths second now to Capable Leader over San Cartel. Another two lengths fourth. I'm looking sharp, and he's flushed first up to the outside by Simcoe's Image, who takes that cover fifth. At the middle and sixth is Miracle Bryan. B.J. Sealster is showing some life from off the back end as he gets underway. That leaves Cumberbund as the trailer of the half in 58 and four. To the back stretch they go, and on the front, it's Whiffed leading the way here. Whiffed by a length. On the outside, I'm a looking sharp. Now moving first up and second. At the rail, capable leader is third with perfect cover. Fourth, Simcoe's image. Inside and five, San Cartel. Racing towards a three-quarter mile marker and Whiffed continues a lead. On the outside, I'm a looking sharp. Right there, applying pressure. Three quarters, 128. At the rail and racing at third, capable leader is well rested and poised to strike. Three wide of the outside comes Simcoe's image. To the top of the stretch now, less than an eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch they come. Whiff clings to the lead. Here comes Capable Leader. Now to the outside, and the battle begins. And it's Whiff, Capable Leader, moving up alongside, and they continue to slug it out. Whiff is a game leader. Capable Leader to the outside. Whiff hangs on by a neck. Capable Leader was second and tight. Trackside is the official winner. Race number eight, number six, Whiff. Six-year-old Ohio bred son of Ironstone L from the Lightning Strikes mare, Strike Mover, owned by Charles Geller, Letha Brooks, and Cheryl Abel of Ohio. Hugh Beatty Jr., the trainer driver. Third win of the season for the six-year-old Pacer. That is a career mark for him. 157 and a one fifth. The $2 Perfecta, 65, $16.20. $16 the $2 Try, 654, $82 even.